What's up YouTube, Joyce here. Uh, today we will make some 3D will be looks like this. It's kind of easy to make it and also just like a simple uh, 3D scene that I make. And also, if you want to have file exactly like this, you can join to be my patron. I will put in for free. You can click link down below and also you can um, grab this one from a Gumroad. I will put link down below also. And if you want to... Uh, Alright guys, so first of all, I'm gonna delete this camera and this light. And if you already do this, let's get choose this cube. And let's get put this cube into this uh, in the middle, in the center here. So grab it by clicking G and then Z control. So just grab it up like that. So I'm gonna take it a little bit um, wide. And here, a little bit longer. So maybe it can be like that was okay. All right, so after that, let's go uh, click tab and choose this this one. And let's get grab it into the up here. And after that, let's go control um, R, add some loop cuts. Right, but I think I want to add more, something like, something like this. All right, if you are ready to do this, let's get do it again. And I'm gonna put here something like that all right that's cool so now i'm gonna um delete all of this so we'll be here just something here now um i'm gonna choose uh all of this here in the middle and click e just try to grab it up all right if you already do this that's cool so now let's go um click some a a cube and um, we will put the cube here and in the middle, in the middle here. And I'm gonna try to put uh, exactly here. All right, so make it more a little bit wide. And just try to make it a little bit after the thickness. We will have something like that. All right, so now um, let's go back again here and I'll grab it with the new um, a window so here I'm gonna add some camera just grab the camera here let's see we have the uh, we have the um, camera now and I'm gonna put exactly here let's get a play around 100 or 40 or something like that but I think not too much like this all right so we can put um, like this and now I'm gonna try to grab it up a little bit like that all right, that's cool. All right, so if you already save your file, let's go uh, continue to this tutorial. First of all, I'm gonna click this um, this object and I will add some bevel. And for a segment, I uh, will using a hundred. And I want a more uh, thickness for this one, so it looks like this. All right, that's cool. So I'm gonna delete that um, cube first. And now let's get add some a uh, icosphere. Here I will using like um, four for subdivision and um, I'm gonna try to grab it up for this something like that and now let's get a uh, grab with this object in the middle here all right so maybe I uh, will put like this that's cool so now we can see all right and I'm gonna duplicate this one by clicking alt D and I want to try to make it a little bit uh, not bigger so just something like that and let's go into the up here all right zip a let's get add some a torus and here i'm gonna add just like um 60 to 60 and for this one just let's try a little bit um bigger and not really um not really so uh certain for this one and now let's go uh, move here let's go grab it here uh for the object all right, so now we can try like that. If it's too big, we can try to make it a little bit small and then we can put here. All right, that's cool. So we have uh, some object here and I think I'm gonna try to take it a uh, little bit far here. So kind of go this one. Grab this one also. All right, so that's cool. Now let's see from here. And now we will add some a 
a light i will using some hdri so all right here i already have some uh, hdri so now let's go to the angel engine i will using cycles and i will activate for uh, gpu and here i just using a uh, mix sample for 10 will be okay and um I will need another window. I will using some setter editor. All right, here we can using um some world. All right, go here, Control T, and we can see about this for the um rotation light, which one that we want to use it. All right, so now I'm gonna add some uh a cube again. Uh, so a plan. So, and now I'm gonna try to grab it into the side back here. All right, that's cool. So let's go break, uh, take it up here. And then now try to get in a little bit longer. I think it was something like, something like that was okay. So now let's get a uh, duplicate this a plan. Let's get grab it this plan here. And now add some uh, solidify. We will add more some thickness for this one. All right, this is looks okay and um, doesn't look uh, so bad. So I'm gonna keep this one and I wanna put here. All right, now let's get add some array. And if you see in this side, it is on the X vector, but I will not using. So I will using on a Y side. I will using like minus and so just click here minus. Uh, 3000 but it can be like this because we didn't uh, delete this one first all right so it'll be looks like that and now i'm gonna add this one will be looks like that it's cool um i do like it but i think if this is uh looks too much but i guess it's not so i will try to keep it something like that all right so now um i'm gonna try to uh see and I want to try to grab this camera a little bit down here. All right, that's cool. And now, all right, that's cool. And now I'm gonna add some a uh, plaster into the uh, wall. So just uh, right here, I using um, Blender Kit. All right, so we can choose which one, uh, which one that you think is good and are not. So I'm gonna choose uh, this one. Click into this object and just wait. All right, that's a little bit cool like that. We can grab it again. It will be looks like this. So we can see a new object like that. All right, so I'm gonna um, unwrap this one by clicking a uh, smart UV project and it will be looks like that. Looks better. And I want to go to this UV editing and I'm gonna block all of that. So now we can see something different here. All right, this is uh, uh, the object that we have it. And now we can using a uh, cube projection. And after that, we can grab it like that. Just try something how it goes, it, uh, how it goes it was for you guys. All right, I'm gonna put something like that and let's go back into the layout and see how it was. All right, this is looks cool. And now let's go back into this um, it's material and here I'm gonna add some wood. It's right here and let's get try which wood that must be good for this one. Um, I wanna try just a little bit like the old one or maybe something better. All right, uh, maybe I will use this one, but I think for that one, it must be not good, but will be this one, will be okay. All right, if you are ready to do this, let's go into, uh, move into this uh, color. I will add some gold one, gold here, and we can choose this, this gold. And also for this um, object here. All right, so now, and this one, I'm gonna just using like some fabric. We can try which the fabric was good for this one. Um, I think I just want this simple one. So maybe uh, this one will be okay. 
all right all right that's cool so now we can uh, do some rotation into this um a object here but i think i will i will just try to make it just simple simple rotation and here for the um frame i will just using like 120 frame so we'll be okay and here i will just like rotation for this one and we'll be just simple one all right if you see this is still empty and we didn't have some keyframe yet and we can choose this one by rotate like that all right so first of all i will put here just click this one and now let's go into the uh 121 and now we can uh click again for a uh, keyframe so now we can see if it's uh if it's moving or not all right this is doesn't seem um moving oh yeah I forget sorry i forgot about that i forget to moving this um object but maybe we can try something like that now we can um all right look at that it was cool but i think i don't want to be something like that just want to be something like this all right so it will be cool will be looks like that we can save again this file and i'm gonna i'm gonna uh grab it this one and and i will put just keep it like this and i will add more um exposure into this uh into this 3d and here i will use this using like 1.5 will be a little bit bright and was better so now go down we will using some, a color management and for this one i will using some uh, high contrast will be looks better all right so guys um tutorial for today it's done it's really easy and i will put this file for free on a gram uh, all right so guys tutorial for today it's done and it's really easy and if you want to have file exactly like this i will put in uh this is exactly file for free on gumroad patreon and so on so if you want to have file exactly like this you can click link down below all right so guys don't forget to like comment and subscribe georgia is here see you in the next video